Jaguar's second crossover may have started life as a Land Rover and a Range Rover, but making it a Jag was job number one. Hi, I'm Aaron Cole from Motor Authority, reporting from Corsica, France, with our first look at this, the 2018 Jaguar E-Pace. And what's a Jag if it doesn't drive well? To that end, the list of changes was fairly substantial. The Jaguar E-Pace gets its own suspension bits, including aluminum steering knuckles and camber rates that prioritize on-road feel. It's firmer than the other two, and even though it's Jaguar's first transverse mounted engine with front wheel drive bias, it's meant to be a sporty driver. But we don't get that front wheel drive version in the States, at least not now. For us, it's all wheel drive all the time. An optional all wheel drive system borrowed from Range Rover is the star of the show. It's true torque vectoring and it's enough to carve a tighter corner or bring the back end around in really loose surfaces. The rest of the powertrain tries to keep up. The E-Pace gets a turbo four, with either 246 horsepower or 296 horsepower and a nine speed automatic. The Turbo 4 is gruff, but has enough meat to get the E-Pace going, but it's not helped by a nine speed with its shoes tied together. Inside the E-Pace plagiarizes the F-Pace's interior look, but without the same material. Leather is standard on most trims, but the soft stuff needs more money. The dash and doors don't have the same feel from the higher buck F-Pace, and it's not as quiet inside. Pushing the front windshield and cabin forward also pushes the front wheels into the footwells, and we'd ask for a little more thigh support from the seats. Packaging seems to be Jag's heel for now, but performance sure isn't. The Jaguar E-Pace adds some driver-centric systems to a platform we already know. It takes a lot of the good bits and adds a more aggressive shape on the exterior. Interior has some highs and lows, but its drivability is still impressive. Reporting from Corsica, France, for Motor Authority, I'm Aaron Cole. Thanks for watching. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, and Instagram.